Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Chupacabra Tutorials channel. I'm your host, Larry, and today I'm going to be talking to you about how you can control the permissions on who gets to use the new soundboard features inside of Discord, so you can control that only, like, say, long-term members of your server are allowed to use it, and random people that constantly jump into your public server can't just start spamming sounds whenever they want inside of a voice chat channel. So in order to control this, all you gotta do is go to your server, go up to your server settings, and then go into your roles. And I'll just go find the everyone role, and you'll find these, per well, I say these, it's one permission right now, and you'll find it underneath of the voice channel specific permissions down here at the bottom of the permissions list. And you'll see down here, there is one in particular that says use soundboard, allows members to send sounds from the server soundboard. If you don't want them to be able to use the soundboard, you can go ahead and disable that here. Now, similarly to other permissions on the server where you can prevent people from using external emojis from other servers on your server because that prevents them from using ones that could be a little risque or offensive, you have the ability of making it so that they can't use external sounds in the soundboard from other servers out and about on Discord. And then those are the two primary sound board related permissions that you can control and you can toggle them on or off right here. I would say that if you find that spamming becomes a problem with the soundboard to disable this for the everyone role and only allow people who have been long-term members of your server the ability to play around with sounds. Similarly, if I go back to this other server, You'll notice that if you're inside of a soundboard enabled server and you don't really want to listen to people spam up the channel with sounds all the time because you find it annoying, you yourself can go to the lower left hand corner, open up the soundboard window, click on this little sort of volume icon and you can manually mute the soundboard so you don't have to bother listening to people spamming up the channel with different sounds. Similarly, I believe if you use the server deafen or mute features inside of the right click feature, you can also mute people and that should block their ability to use the soundboard as well. If not, just remember that you can always mute it manually by simply going inside of here. You can also put it back similarly. So hope that helps you in moderating and using the new Discord soundboard. I've been your host, Larry. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll catch you next time. Bye everybody and have a good one.